Hi everybody, welcome to today's video. Today we are going to be reacting to the most iconic K-drama scenes of all time. I've watched over 200 dramas, so I made the list myself to be honest of all of the iconic scenes that I like remember and I know will like bring up like the fluttery feelings within us. So let's go. Of course, if I missed any scenes or if there are more scenes that you want me to react to, please put them in the comments. I will do a second part. So scene number one that we're starting with is from Crash Landing on You. I'm talking about the scene where she's running to the demarcation line. Let's go. <sighs> you guys, I want to love like this. This is so unfair. Reality is so unfair. Everybody's just frozen looking at them, even they don't know what to do. Same. It's like they need each other, like they can't let each other go from how much they just mean to each other. Her skin is so perfect. I can't, I can't. It's one of those scenes that only happen like every once in a while in K-dramas where you genuinely feel the love and passion between the two people and it's just great and heartbreaking. <laughs> Speaking of a great and heartbreaking, the next scene we're going to watch is from Scarlet Heart Rio, Moon Lovers. It's the scene where she's crying in the rain and he comes and flings out his cape for her as if he legitimately came out of an anime. So that's what we're watching now. <laughs> I still can't believe she killed the court lady just because she was jealous. Like, ma'am, calm down. I watched this like four years ago and I still remember how idiotic the queen was. Ayu is such a great actress. I hate him. I cannot stand his ass in this drama. Oh, look. Oh my god. your fault you couldn't say anything <sighs> I still can't watch this scene until today no what are you sad <sighs> but the OST makes me want to cry look at him protecting her and trying to help her He's always been hubby, always. The other guy never had a chance. It's like I like being in pain. This scene is iconic because Lee Jung Gi, all of his actions, all of his everything like Wang So was such one of the most beautiful characters I've ever met in a K-drama and every single scene between them is either beautiful or heartbreaking there is no in between I was thinking of watching it again and like making a reaction series on it what do y'all think I feel like we could all use some venting ground for Scarlet Heart Rio together hey let's go on to happier moments the next scene is from Fight For My Way we have the Aegyo scene between Park So Joon and Kim Ji Won Aegyo means cute so this is the scene where they like act cute together. I love this scene. She really is so cute. She started the trend for being like cute in that drama. Yeah. 
Iconic! Oh my god! <laughs> They're all so disgusted! At the awards show, they showed Park Seo Joon and Kim Ji Won this scene like on the live screen and they reacted to it while they were sitting down in front of everybody and it was so embarrassing. You could see Park Seo Joon's face wanting to like go under the earth. But the scene itself is so hilarious. This drama too is so good and easy to watch. The next scene, we're gonna go on the trend of lightheartedness, is from weightlifting fairy Kim Bok Ju. I think y'all know which scene I'm talking about. It's the catchphrase of the century, your K drama pickup line that includes messy. I wish I had her confidence, to be honest. And her eyes. Her eyes are so gorgeous. Oh, and then she starts walking, and then she's gonna start running. <laughs> go, Bok Ju! Oh, I feel nervous for her. <laughs> oh, why did she expect that to be a thing? I really like honestly though, how am I to judge her? Who am I to judge her? At the end, she had a beautiful relationship. They were strong together. I have no one. So I have nothing to judge her with. I'm just gonna shut up. <laughs> the next scene is from Kill Me, Heal Me. It's my favorite scene of all time. Do Hyun turns into his alter ego, the girl, and starts like attacking Ryoni. I legitimately don't even need subtitles for this. I've memorized every single word of it. <laughs> <laughs> Ji Sung, top class actor. Oh, yeah, Yuna, that was his alter ego. Ugh, I need to rewatch this drama. Park Sejun looks so cute. I I've memorized this, you guys. <clears throat> Cha. Cha. Oh. Ah. Ryoni till now probably has PTSD in the K-drama world. <laughs> oh my god. If you're handsome, you're my oppa. That's it. That was the line. I don't know when this dra drama came out, but that was the line. The scene goes on for like four more minutes and then he like chases him down the street and then they kiss and it, it's, it's honestly just hilarious. The next scene is also with Park So Joon. It's that scene from What's Wrong with Secretary Kim, which is basically almost 18 plus. And we're just going to watch like seven seconds of it so I can feel more single. You guys, I remember when the scene came out, the first thought in my head was why is there no music and why do I need to listen to them uh, mooching? An iconic scene, but I don't think I can react to it on camera just because like, it's so intimate. The next scene is truly iconic. It's the scene from Goblin. Gong Yu and Lee Dong Wook walk down the street eerily and charismatically to save Kim Go On. Zaddy. They're both almost, well, Gongyu's 41, but like the hottest 41 year old I've ever seen in my life. And Lee Dong Wook. <gasps> Amazing. Wow. A plus production. 
The next scene is from our favorite It's Okay to Not Be Okay. It's the scene where Moon Young tells her love confession to Kang Tae, and we all know how that went. So let's rewatch it. <laughs> they really went through a lot. <laughs> I remember these lines and how much they annoyed me. I agree. Kang Tae Shi. Why do I always feel Loki offended whenever Kang Tae spoke in the first eight episodes? Why? Why Somebody needed anger management classes in the first couple of episodes. <laughs> But honestly, one of the most iconic love confessions of all time because it's like well and clear in my head. Okay, the next scene is from Legend of the Blue Sea. It's the scene where he comes in holding the umbrella after she got lost in the first episode. Let's watch. You guys, I love this K-drama's OST. It's love story. I love his sandals, they really make a statement. This is amazing! When you can only sing the English parts of the Korean songs. <laughs> Jenjian's skin is the smoothest skin I've ever seen in my life. Like, it's amazing. I really, really love Legend of the Blue Sea. I thought it was such a unique drama. Okay, are y'all ready to be shocked shocked? So Secretary Kim has one of the most intense kiss scenes of like K-drama history. And there is another drama that preceded that that had the most intense kiss scene in K-drama history. And it's a drama called Another Miss O. Let's watch. He's in trouble. Oh yeah, and in secretary. No, in fight for my way, they were watching this scene at some point. Or secretary Kim, I can't remember. I remember. <laughs> oh my god. Ugh, I forgot the scene. It was so low-key hot of violence. <laughs> she bit him. Oh my god. <laughs> and then they start kissing. <laughs> I can't. Oh my god. I remember. Whoa. Oh my god. Really? Oh. No. Oh my god, and then he walks away. I know how this drama ends and I still want to dropkick him. Okay, so this next scene is from one of my favorite romantic comedies of all time. It's from the drama Jealousy Incarnate starring Jo Jung Suk and Gyeong Kyo Jin. And I swear to God, you guys, if you already didn't love Jo Jung Suk, this scene will make you want to marry him, even though he's already married to the most amazing OST singer, Gummy. But like this scene, mwah. Also the premise of this romantic comedy is so unique. He had breast cancer and she like took care of him and like they grew together. I'm rewatching it right now. Oh my god. 
아니 나한테 대신 자꾸 선발아 나가달라고 할 때부터 뭔가 이상했어. He's so amused. 네? 너나 질투하냐? 아니거든요. No, you are. You are. I loved how much he loved her, and they grow. They both grew so much together. I wish I had him. Oh. He's so like, I want to marry him. Look how happy he is because she likes him. That's it. <laughs> what do you think? He's literally doing pirouettes. Like, I just. I love feeling more and more single as time goes by. I will make other parts to this. Tell me guys, what scenes are you looking forward to seeing? Uh, comment down below and I will work on making part two. As for other videos, they're going to come out three times a week. Don't know when, they just do. So I hope you stay here and let's enjoy this K-drama journey together. Bye guys, I love you all.